this here is the bright sign device um, it's a mini device used for digital signage you can mount it at the back of your display in one or multiple locations and you could control everything that is going on on those leds or those screens rather from um, one single point of um, control they come in different configurations and if you want the wi-fi um, module installed you have to buy it separately and install it yourself and that's what i will be showing you how to do in this video in the box for the wi-fi module you should find uh, a pair of antennas um, some washers a screw maybe and the wi-fi card itself with its connecting cable let me use this opportunity to ask that you subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet this would encourage me to produce more videos like this on the channel. There are other ways of supporting the channel, which is by buying me a coffee. The links would be in the description. Anyway, let's get back to it. There are four screws at the bottom of the panel, and we will be taking that with a Phillips screwdriver, and um, that should expose the panel um, for us to see where to um, insert the Wi-Fi card. Use a pointed tip, maybe a screwdriver, just to lift the top um, plastic off once you unscrew it. Um, here is the panel. Um, it's one single panel that exists um, inside this um, casing. Now we're going to try to lift this up. Um, you want to take the two sides out. It, it just um, You could just push it out from um, both ends and it's just going to come out. It's not screwed um, to the case initially, so you can take it out. So to lift the panel up, you simply need to uh, take note, it's not screwed, by the way. So you just need to push it away from those four points that you had unscrewed earlier. You just need to lift it up with your fingers. So you're going to gently slide your fingers under the panel um, right in the case, those, those empty spaces um, on, the, on the two sides. So you're going to put your fingers there and try to lift the panel up. Once the panel lifts itself up from those um, razors, you could gently slide it both ways till you are able to get it out of the chassis. It's also important, I do mention that um, this should have been from the beginning. Make sure you discharge yourself of any static electricity or have a band on. Um, I'm just going to place this to the side. Um, it's just a single panel, like I said. Everything is an, in one enclosure. And here is a space for the Wi-Fi module. This is where it's going to go into. I'm just going to lay down this panel and get the Wi-Fi module and unwrap it. Just the same way you would fit this into a laptop and um, the same way you would also fit uh, an SSD stick. So I'm going to slide this into its um, slot and push it downwards. You would need a screw. A screw comes in the wrap, so you need a screw to also screw it down to make sure it remains in place. As for the dangling cables you see on the Wi-Fi module, those belong to the antennas. So you're going to take up the plastics for the side that has the antenna, the one that has the two black um, rubbery thing um, on the side. We're going to take the rubber out, they're just covers, and that's where the antenna will go into. Now you want to make sure also that it, you place this on the side where it's going to be to make sure that because one of the cable or one of the antenna is longer than the other one. So make sure you place it um, in the chassis, put the cables through the way it's supposed to be before putting it into the white cover to make sure it's in place. You do not want to forget to use the washers. Um, make sure you put in the washers also before you screw. Now to screw this, you probably need a long nose plier, a small plier that you could use to screw this once, um, you're, done, once you're done spinning this in. Um, the other side is well fitted into a space so it's not going to turn while you're using the plier. Once you're done with that part, you want to tuck in the cable to make sure they don't get in the way when you're ready to screw back the panel or the cover. When putting back the panel, make sure it's sitting properly on those risers, the same one you push them away from when you're taking it out. Gently slide the covers or the white covers back in, the ones on the on both ends, the one that has the ports. After doing that, there are two tiny screws packaged in there. Um, you want to make sure you use them before you put the panel back. What these screws do, they belong in one tiny space at the bottom of the case. And what it does is to hold in place the parts where the ports are to make sure it never slides 
out. The other one is held by a notch, so it's pretty safe on the other side. Once that's done, you want to put the cover back and put all the screws back and we are good to go. Of course, you also have to screw in the antennas when you are done. And finally, please support the channel. Subscribe if you haven't, like, share and hit the bell icon so you know when a new video hits. There are other ways of supporting the channel, which is buying me a coffee. The link is in the description. And of course, if you need to buy the bright sign, a purchase link is also in the description. It's an affiliate link. It means I get a commission for every purchase you make. Till next time, bye-bye.